this is me unlocking my phone my Sprint iPhone 4s with Tippy SIM um, I don't know if you've heard about this technology it was developed by China's no team these were the first people to unlock the iPhone 4s but they just got overwhelmed by these people so as you can see this is this is waiting for activation this is only done by CDMA phones so I just want to prove that this is a CDMA phone from Sprint you'll see it has a SIM card comes with it that says Sprint see for this to work the phone has to be jailbroken so you have to be either in 5.0 or 5.0.1 5.1 definitely will not work so let me just show you in the settings what I'm talking about as you can see this is a iPhone in a 5.0 32 gigs from Sprint so you can see the model number here this is only seen in the Sprint phone number, this MD380LL, okay? So I'm going to start by downloading the app that comes along with this. So as you can see here, <coughs> in the back side you have a PIN number for you to get the application. You have to add this source, which is cityatip.tpsim.com. I'll put it up in my tutorial later on okay so I'm gonna start by downloading the app see the phone couldn't be activated because this phone this phone has a bad ESN so it can't be used so I'm gonna ignore this I'm gonna start the activation process let's get the, the application first let's go to Cydia sit down for a second okay Cydia once we're there we just go manage the sources we go edit add and we look for the the repo seria.tpsim.com okay so we're adding the repo it's verifying the URL once you do this have to go and download an app for this and as you can see here too they added a code for the app so once you download it you have to put this code this is why you have to buy it from the original maker which is TPSM okay you have to make sure that this is the Sprint version there's a version for Verizon and another one for Sprint and for every city I make carrier KVDI I think from Japan and some other places in China I don't know but every carrier that has a CDMA iPhone 4S has to have one of these things otherwise it will not work okay so we're back so I took out the SIM card from my phone the one I'm using to record this video is an orange card, SIM card Orange Dominican Republic that's where I am right now so I'm gonna use it to to unlock this phone right that's on Sprint Network using tip is SIM so we shall begin by opening this up. All right. So we go. Okay, extreme snow. We have this. Uh, I skipped that part. So once you're here, this app it'll it'll make you it'll help you unlock the phone, right? So you need to get the right APN settings. So this is why it has this button. <clears throat> once you hit it, you're taken to that website where you can download different APN settings for different types of phones. In my case, I'm gonna get APN APN settings for Orange Dominican Republic. So Orange, done. We will create profile. Once it does this, it'll ask you to install the carrier settings to orange. You pick them and hit install. Install now. So once you've done this, you have to go to the next step. Go well done. And then go back to Extreme Snow. You have to register the app. You have to use a code that's on the the thing as you can see mine is right here I'm not gonna show you the whole thing you have to buy it for that so I'm gonna type it in okay so 
I'm gonna skip this part with you guys. So we've done it. Let's put the TP SIM card and my SIM card inside the phone. So let's open it up. It's kind of hard using one hand. So here's the TP SIM. Just like any regular Gibby or anything else you've seen before not much to see here just a little thing in there you just have to put your sim card in the middle and put it in the phone that's what I'm expecting so where is the sim card oh, right here. so see as you can see here this is the orange card that showed you before it's kind of messed up because I cut it for the other sims so I put it in position right and I put it into the phone again iPhone 4S you can tell by this little thing right here so we put it in let's see what happens I haven't tested this before so you're seeing pretty much my first time so we put it in let's see what happens okay as I told you before we're back here in the video um, we were making the TP SIM for iPhone 4S Sprint CDMA. We were trying to set it up, so we added the repo, which is the one back here. Okay, you see it? Cydia.tpsim.com. So we added it, we have it right here. So we're going to install the app for the SIM card to work. So let me see, let's focus this. So we go. Pick the sim, install extreme snow. Go here, install some Chinese stuff there. Go confirm. Hitting this app. Remember, in order for the sim to work, you have to have this app installed. So you have to restart the springboard. Okay, so we're back in action. You go here, slide to unlock. Again, let me show you this is an iPhone 4S from Sprint. <coughs> this is the SIM card it has inside. Right here, Sprint 11.1. And this is the modal number. You can look it up and you'll see this is a 32 gig from Sprint. Okay, so we go. Let's take out the SIM card that this phone has. One second. So, I took it out, my SIM card installed. So we go here, let me show you that this is the Sprint SIM card that came along with the phone. See, you can see it there. This is Sprint, this is the part. So, we take this off. <coughs> We're gonna try this phone with another SIM card so let me just take out the one that I'm, the phone I'm using to record this video hold on still waiting on it to happen oh yeah there you go as you can see, it took signal from orange, right? So let me show you from a little closer so you can see that this is actually happening. For those of you with hopeless phones out there, this is your solution. So as you can see, let me show you that it has data working. I have to disable Wi-Fi. So, okay, we're back. 
we're having problems with the APNs. But as you can see here, this is 3G. Uh, although the page, same page I, have, I was look, trying to do before. Fix the settings. So I lay times right now. Okay. So as you can see, you have loaded the page pretty well. Let's see if it can load the full site. Press the wrong button. Let's go to view full site. There you go. Loading pretty fast. Yeah, everything seems to be working okay. And, um, the other one I wanted to show you is a speed test. You can see this is working at 3G speeds. Depends on your carrier. It could be this could be slower or faster. So let's begin the test. Okay, very decent, I would say, for a third world country. Everything is orange, you see, orange 3G. No wife. So the last test I want to do for you guys is to re reboot the phone, see if it goes back with the signal up. So I'm turning it off now. See what happens. So this solution is supposed to work on iPhone 4S running either iOS 5.0 or 5.0 okay so phone is booting up again I don't think it'll have signal right away you probably have to wait again let's see battery is running low see what happens Does it have any or anything. See, so it has to go through the process. So every time you reboot your phone, in case you run out of battery or I know you have meeting and you have to turn it off or whatever, um, you have to go through this process. It takes three to four minutes to complete. But once it's done, your phone is completely unlocked. You have 3G service as you saw before, and you also have a um, um, signal you can make calls. So I'm gonna make a call to show you. So it seems like it's going a little faster this time. See, so, so they go phone. Let's make a call. I don't know. It's the service for this phone company. Bienvenido al mundo orange. La red GSM número uno del país. So you see you have service, let me get it's called, I don't know, some crazy number, I don't know. Styling. Al So there's some Spanish stuff there. So, so you can see the phone is working. It has signal there. Let's focus again. You still, you see it there. This is not a lie. I'm not getting anything out of it, but I just want to everybody to know that this actually works you don't have to keep your phone anymore in a drawer like I did I'll put links to where you, of, as of where you can buy this TP SIM stuff it works really good thank you bye